Is that, I think that's the right way. What the fuck is this? What the fuck is this? What are you? Secret found. Oh! Oh! Oh no! Oh, that was a secret? Ah, oh, shit! The gate opened there. What about you? Are you gonna come out? Yeah, you're gonna come I out. This is a hard role to play, but I too have a world to save. Without their souls, there can be no hell energy, and the Argent will cease to flow. I cannot allow this to happen. You will not stand in the way of Erdak's progress. This is how it has always been done. It is not for you to deny us our chance at prosperity. So is their world dying, or, or is she just wants to get it be immortal? Even the the, the hell priest. There's something down here. Oh, it's another lore. God damn, there's too many lores here. The history of the Sentinels. Let's see. They fought the demons. The makers like their gods. Let's see what it says. As we wore the beast in the Arjuna uh, society grew, under the wrathful eyes of the Maker and through the endless power of the Incets, while our generals were consumed with the unholy war, our culture, our culture was marked by the beautiful potion the enemies had provided us, the sweet elixir. It brought us immersible capacity and empowered us to reach further into dimension, once thought to be beyond our grasp under the direction of our maker, gods, and engineering of our high priest, our weapon blaze and our war machine storm. The throng of our populace drank deeply from the well of energy, unveiled by the priest, but we of the Ninth Sentinels took no part of their uh, abdonis. Some among us whispered uh, accusation and warning against the manner of progress, but they were quilled, as was not our rule to dictate the future of our people, only to defend it. So it looked like the nice thing were uh, question questioning of uh, what's uh, what they're doing. So if the hell priests in the makers just want energy to make them immortal, power, all that bullshit. That's what they're doing. Is there a crack here? No. It has to be a way. Oh, it's the other side. It has to be the other side. Yeah, it's the other side. So they're using her almost escape goals. They need the hell energy. Okay, the Okay, there's three more secrets. That's a boss. I'm gonna fight a boss. <laughs> Fucking hell. Maybe it's the Titan. Maybe we're gonna fight the Titan. What the hell is this? Is that the Doom guy? He has the sword. As the Black Star ascended to the Senate, King Novik sat rentless on his throne as a howling darkness began to assemble just beyond the mountain rise to the east. The blight came upon us and drove, flooding forth from the hell gate with merciless fairy. fairy. They uh, brought with them a monstrous titan, the Dreadnought, a beast to rival the stretcher and the menace of even the mightiest essential. The grassroots giant laid waste to all before him. Crushing all in his path, this was a total demonic assault, striking the heart of Archon Denor, as never before. How is how was it that the, the behemoth could pass through the demonic gate without warning? We will never know through the Night Sentinels believed treason was at play. Caught off all, off guard, the Sentinels uh, scrambled late in the, def the defiance of the Titan and his horde, and with his coming to the holy city of Taurus, no bad, prepared for judgment, with the onslaught of the demons and masses and sprawling shadow of the 
abhorrent fiend. The, the city shook for to its foundation. None were spared, save those that fled north. The vile swarm ransacked our temples and palace, burning our towers and feasting on the souls of our clergy. Yet, the night sentinels rallied and held fast against the demons, though they were pushed back in the curled at the blood arena. As the dark of night descended, their sword remained potent and shred the energy of the molitude with abandon. And missed the unyielding rank of the sentinels, when all other apprentices had fallen in battle, stood the outlander, rip and tear. He roared, ferocious in battle. The remaining concept of the arena stood away as they witnessed the beast who had once raged within their very cell. Now armored alongside the shoulder of his sentinel brethren, he had risen from none other had before. A true born sentinel fighter, the very best among them. But though the swarm fell before their assault, the titan remained invisible, for none could tame the behemoth alone. In the hour before dawn, as the night sentinel withered a relentless onslaught or assault, the outlander held in his ground at the foot of the great wall in the northern bend of the castle, seeing is his un unending vigor some more and Chancellor to the Mother God Harried the outlander away under the veil of the secrecy and for reason unknown Submitted him to the right untold This was heresy for Samor received no consent from the conmaker nor did he re uh, receive uh, Her counsel in the chapel of purity the outlander submitted himself to the divinity machine there some more some more maker the Sephirim known as us to only as the aid to the mother god blessed the outlander with the fierce speed and power to match his will it was the method by which the this uh, transfusion took place that was most uncertain to us for we were acknowledged that the maker devised both um bespo uh, bestowed onto the argenta so many generations ago was the to be used by the priests only to find the impurity among us. How could it be that the device that was meant to call the sentinels breed of its contentment could even be used to purify the outlander's body and give rise to one could will lead us into battle henceforth? What rose from the holy coffin on that fateful day was not the impure uh, abomination the, co the covenant warned us uh, the hero within should would come to known as only the great slayer, the time walker, the warrior Khan, whose fire sword will blaze forth the path for the just and cut through the demonic horde with the vengeance and that only God King could summon. He rolls unbroken by the ritual, his eyes burning with the maker's magic. He took the crucible in his hand and wraith fire leaped forth from the blade it's only a will it only will when held by the true sentinel warrior king in our darkest hour the slayer has been chosen uh, defying tradition our most sacred law and the will of the great khan herself a stranger to our land had been blessed with a sentinel might shit that is the doom guy and that is his sword god damn it Fucking Samuel took my sword. That armor looks kind of badass. Well, the helmet. So the mar marauder was right. I am a fake. Cause this is not my land. I'm just an outsider. Let's see. Okay, there's two more. Two more. Two more lords, I think. God damn it. Are you gonna show yourself again? Yep. yep. And the energy will continue to flow. It is your people's survival against mine. Hey, hey, it's your fault. You went after Earth. If you did not, I would not do this. D graph. Oh. Is this something, bitch? What the fuck happened to him? Like for reals, look! 
<laughs> Look at the comparison. <laughs> For some reason, he turned into a monster in the right. First, he was human, but now he's... Oh, what the fuck happened to him? Maybe too much... Too much, uh... Hell energy? Maybe he got... Like, too consumed with it? Fuck. Did his people did not know what was going on with him? D. Grav remained the most powerful of the hell priests among the... People of Argentinor, frequently visiting his ancient homeworld to lord over the populace. Argent, uh, uh, arrogant and populous, Graf called for the blood sport in the arena to entertain the fallen citizens of the Central Prime. Since the demonic invasion of Earth began, he has he has operated on the planet's surface, along with his hell, uh, his fellow hell priests, to direct hell forces. But after the death of D. Nox or D. N uh, Nelix and D. Rannick, he has fled to the safety of the arena. It was D. Graf who facilitated the torment and the eventual betrayal of the Central Commander Valin, uh, taking the key to the Sulfur of Elements and opening the vault of the Sleeping Wraiths. The ancient creatures were abducted, transported to hell, and tortured to. Siphon away their power. He used the heart of Valen's son to an animate the Icon of Sin, a titan still spoken of legend throughout the Argent Donor. Motherfucker, he was this guy. He pretty much did everything. The son. Uh, what? 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 Are they? Are they here? Oh. Hello, Pinky. Is that hell? Oh. Can I kill him? That's a Hell Knight. That's a Elite Hell Knight. Another he Elite. Another Hell Knight. You got a lot of Hell Knights. That's a Pinky. That's it. I don't trust this shit. I'm going to the arena. Last one, Gladiator. Are you fucking kidding me? Are you fucking kidding me? Is this who I'm going to fight? <laughs> Is this who I'm going to fight? I gotta read about this fucker. Okay, there's no weak points. Fuck. Shit. In the year of the falling of the end of the Golden Age, competing factions of the Archer du Nord turned against one another. An insidious influence has best uh, bestowed itself upon the Sentinel peoples. Corrupting its once held secret tradition. The Colosseum, once uh, a place of honorable combat where prisoners of Argent were tested for the right to fight in the front line of their army, has since become a place of blood sport. In violation of the Sentinel law, the priest has encaged a demon there, a merciless executioner, used to attack a uh, judgment of their own decree, the gladiator, wielding a cursed shield which entombed the torment souls of his undying master. Uh, remain undefeated in battle, infamous for his many life as it claim. So, they no longer hiring people who won in the to uh, torment. It's just now blood sports. Fuck, I don't, don't want to fight this fucker. to the front line, stranger. The demons! They are everywhere. Must kill them all! Dress his wounds and bring him to us. I want to know more about the others he speaks of. Yes, your grace. <laughs> if Sentinel Holy Blood is spilled on these grounds, you will lose all sovereignty here.
When the sh shield eyes flash green, the gladiator is about to attack. Shoot him when his eyes are green to stagger him and create an opening. Come on, you fucking bastard. I think I hit him a little bit. Come on. Fucking shield is alive! Fucking so of a bitch! Holy crap! That's kinda creepy! Yeah, I hit him. Bitch. Okay. But I need some ammo. Ah, fuck. Give me ammo. Give me ammo. Give me ammo. Thank you, thank you. Your sacrifice will not be in vain. Bitch. Okay, there's so many. Eat this. Oh, that hurts him too. The fucking grenade hurts him too. What the fuck? He threw his shield at me? It looked like he threw his shield. Fuck. I gotta take down this teleport. Is this teleport dead? Yeah, the teleport this guy is dead. I think... No, I said that already. Fuck. The shield is alive too. Oh, he's shooting. Or hitting me. Got this. There we go. Punch the shit out of you. Oh, you killed your friend. <laughs> oh shit. Fuck, fuck, fucking hell knight. Get it. Oh, oh, come on. Ready for some ammo. I still got this. Uh, this could hurt you a little Oh, they did a lot of damage. That did a lot of damage. Come on, you silly bitch. I know what to do. I know what to do. <laughs> bitch. Okay, they didn't hurt me. Oh, oh, that was close. That was close there. That was close. Little by little, taking help. Fuck. Give me help, give me shield, give me shield, thank you, thank you. There we go, is he actually dead? Where the fuck he got that other fucking mace? <laughs> Without his shield, the gladiator is more aggressive and has wielded a wider variety of attack. When the gladiator spins one of his uh, flails, it, re it returns attack, but the to the player. When the gladiator's eyes flash green, is about to is he's about to strike. God damn it! I gotta wait for his eyes green again. Shit! I was going I was happy for a while there. Bitch. Damn it. Grenade, bitch. Can't dodge that. Yeah, you can't dodge that. Shit. Can't hit him still. Yeah, I can still hit him. Okay, without if he does that, I can't hit him. He like sends he sends it back. Shield. Ooh, okay. Fucking hell. 
There we go. That did a lot of damage. Man, thank you for giving me some ammo. Hi, ammo. Help. Oh shit! Bitch! Fuck! He's almost dead. Shit, 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 he's almost dead. He's almost dead. Come here! Shit, shit! I thought I had fucking flamethrower. Bitch. Can I hit him still? Yeah, I just hit him still. Bitch! I ain't tired with your bullshit! Alright, uh... What? Can I do a lot of damage with this? Let me see. <laughs> come on, come on, come on, come on! There we go! Ah, you fucking piece of shit! Fuck your flail! Oh, am I actually gonna fucking use it against them? <laughs> oh shit! What is that? This stops nothing. Earth will be consumed, regardless of what. So what now? I mean like, we defeated the Hell Priest. What now? I'm confused, what's gonna happen now? No, 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 okay. Uh, continue.